Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and today in this video we are going to look at the Lewis structure for H2O2 which is also known as hydrogen peroxide or dihydrogen dioxide because it has two hydrogen atoms and two oxygen atoms and to understand its Lewis structure we are first going to look at the total number of valence electrons for this molecules. So hydrogen has one valence electron and oxygen has six valence electrons in its outer shell but we have two hydrogen atoms and two oxygen atoms so we have a total of 14 valence electrons for H2O2. Once you know the number of valence electrons start arranging the atoms and showing bonds. So here we are going to place oxygen atoms here and we are going to place hydrogen atoms on their sides like this. Now each hydrogen atom just requires one valence electrons to attain a stable structure so we are going to form a bond by sharing two valence electrons between each oxygen and hydrogen atom and there will be a bond between oxygen atoms as well. So doing that we have used up six valence electrons out of 14 and we are now left with eight more electrons. You can see here the octets for hydrogen atoms are now complete because it has two valence electrons in its outer shell. The rest of the electrons will try to arrange around oxygen atoms and check if it helps in completing their octets. So we are going to place 2, 4, 6 and 8. Doing that we have complete octates for oxygen atoms because it has 8 valence electrons in its outer shell and hydrogen atoms have 2 valence electrons in its outer shell. So this is the Lewis structure for H2O2 and I hope this video helps you to understand how to determine the Lewis structure of any molecule. For more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecule, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.